Until July 4th, the performance in the UAE where 673 drones were used was considered the most massive drone show. However, Sky Elements managed to break this record and get into the Guinness World Records. During the celebration of Independence Day in the USA, 1,002 drones simultaneously created installations in the sky over Texas. One 3D picture was replaced by another, reminding the audience of key moments in the country's history, from the early settlers to the moon landing. All the drones were controlled automatically by a single computer. Preparation on the launch site began 12 hours before the show. The drones were manually checked and connected one by one to the control center. The last drones were connected just minutes before the start. However, the result was worth it. Dreaming of becoming a world champion in arm wrestling but your physique doesn't allow it? Don't despair! YouTuber Alan Pan has a solution to this problem. He invented an unusual device, an exoskeleton for arm wrestling. Armed with his invention, Pan challenged the regulars at Muscle Beach, a popular spot among bodybuilders in Santa Monica. He offered to pay $100 to anyone who could defeat him in arm wrestling. Several people accepted the challenge, but no one could overcome the mechanical power of the exoskeleton until the device broke down. After several matches, the winch cable got tangled, causing an overload and breaking the electric motor. This allowed the last participant in the unique competition to defeat Penn and claim the well-deserved $100. Another record holder is the Toyota Q5 basketball playing robot. It has been listed in the Guinness World Records as the most accurate basketball playing robot. The human-sized droid successfully made 2,020 consecutive free throws. The robot's achievement is astonishing. By the way, the continuous free throw series of the well-known NBA sniper Stephen Curry is only 80 baskets per season. Recently, Q5 also performed at the Ibaraki Robots match showcasing its dribbling skills. Additional movement axes in its left hand made the motions of the new model smoother. According to the project leader, this allowed for dribbling that was previously impossible. The droid is equipped with a new system that determines the distance from its palms to the ball and recognizes its exact position. It is programmed to read the ball's position with every bounce and make decisions on how to move its hand accordingly. Poor Power Ocean has introduced its first industrial wave energy converter, C4. The device has a rated power of 300 kilowatts and is a unique wave energy system in the form of a large buoy. The installation is capable of generating five times more energy compared to other power stations of the same type, while costing a third less. The C4 housing is designed using an inexpensive multi-layer construction. It consists of composite shells separated by the main material. The buoy floats on the ocean surface, moving with the waves and is moored to the seabed. Approximately midway between the buoy and the anchor, there is a mechanism that converts wave energy from linear motion to rotational, generating electricity. The device has already successfully passed tests. The deployment of the farm in the ocean is planned for the end of this year.
Imagine an ATV that can drive on your lawn without damaging it. Hard to believe, right? Well, it already exists. The machine from the Finnish company 18 Wheels has an original chassis with 18 wheels. Each of them is equipped with its own small electric motor and suspension system, making off-road driving much more comfortable. Having 18 wheels instead of 4 significantly reduces the pressure on the terrain. Moreover, the independent suspension system allows the Finnish invention to effortlessly handle obstacles. The ATV can traverse rocks up to 14 inches high, overcome fallen trees and even climb stairs. The developers claim that no existing ATV built on a standard scheme can match such level of off-road capability. The previous invention with a slight upgrade could be highly valuable for exploring other planets such as Mars. Recently, four volunteers offered to live for a whole year in a Martian habitat. The 3D printed facility covers an area of 1700 square feet. Scientists believe that this experiment will provide valuable insights into the challenges that the first Mars expedition will face including the psychological well-being of astronauts. Additionally, the program will simulate a situation where the station's equipment malfunctions completely. HP has introduced the Site Print Robot, which autonomously prints markings on construction sites. According to the manufacturer, the device can speed up construction work up to 10 times. After loading notes from drawings and plans, the robot transfers them onto the rough surface of the floor. This significantly simplifies the labor-intensive manual process of site layout planning. The robot can work on uneven surfaces and overcome obstacles up to 0.7 inches high. The device can print straight lines, text markings, arrows, and additional symbols on the floor. The robot is equipped with two rechargeable batteries, each providing up to four hours of printing. The device has already been tested on various projects ranging from airports to hospitals. Heating water in a swimming pool is a significant expense. To save money for water enthusiasts, the Garisol A1 Glass Solar Pool Heating System comes to the rescue. It is an environmentally friendly and clean source of energy. It stands out for its practicality and cost-effectiveness. The device has a spiral round shape and is made of special polymer pipes. The collector can heat water up to 93 degrees Fahrenheit. It is installed on the roof and can withstand temperatures up to 176 degrees Fahrenheit. The system also has special UV protection. The device is fastened with special brackets made of carbon steel, which are coated with an electrostatic field. Solar heating collectors can be installed in residential pools as well as in pools of sports centers, clubs, and hotels. Can a robot be a good waiter? Yes. To prove this, a team of scientists from the University of Munich created a robotic arm mounted it on a robot and connected it to a computer. The robot's arm picks up a glass filled to the brim with water, lifts it and carries it without spilling a drop. And all of this, the robot does faster and more accurately than a human. How does it work? The team simply fed the robot centuries-old algebraic formulas. This means that the robot's movements are limited by basic principles of geometry. 
As a practical application of their work, the scientists envision innovative robotic support for the elderly and those in need of care. Such a robot is fully capable of serving a glass of water. When even a small amount of moisture gets inside a drone, all its electronics instantly fail. But not the TJ Flying Fish Copter, which can not only fly but also swim underwater. The drone's design is similar to a regular quadcopter's layout. When it flies, the propellers face upward. When the device is submerged in water, the propellers flip 180 degrees and the engines switch to lower speeds. While maneuvering in the water, the robot blades rotate at a certain angle. After submersion, the drone can take off directly from the water surface. The battery capacity allows the drone to fly for about 6 minutes and swim underwater for up to 40 minutes. It can dive to a depth of up to 3 meters. The drone is fully autonomous and can perform tasks without human intervention. Which invention impressed you the most? Share your opinion in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. There's plenty more exciting information from the world of science and technology for you to discover.